What's up, guys? MXB Vibes here at Guadalupe Point Peak, rather, which is the highest point in Texas up there. Um, I'm about a fourth of the way, uh, 8.5 miles total round trip, 3,100, give or take or so of elevation gain. So a lot of steps, but just want to turn the camera on for a second while I walk up this hill and just kind of encourage you guys to, to just jump, you know, um, I don't know the name of the, or the title of the video, but I just encourage you to jump, not jump as in like, I'm not going to jump right now, but I'll get to that. So what I mean by jump is, so Steve Harvey wrote a book called jump and I read it very inspiring, right? It talks about jumping and going for your dreams and goals, you know? Um, I apologize if I sound a little winded again. Elevation gain, so. But it's about jumping and going for your dreams, right? I think, and I've talked about this on my channel plenty of times, about having that fear and being afraid to jump. You know, it's... It's encouraged today to just stay complacent, all right? To stay settled, to stay in the position or title, career, wherever you're at, to just be complacent. And like, I believe you should go after your dreams. Like, we don't know what's in the afterlife, you know? Even if you don't believe in depth, death as a concept, like some cultures do, you know, we all leave this physical body at some point. And so you wanna, you know, you wanna you wanna go after your dreams, you know, like the fact that I'm even right here, you know what I mean? I've I've come a long way myself. You know, I was at a point where I was scared to do anything because of not just rejection, but just that fear of, of failing, right? Having a safety net. That's really what it is. It's having that safety net. You know, when you start living life, I'm not talking about being reckless because there's a difference between living without a safety net and being reckless, right? I'm talking about going after your dreams, not caring about anybody's opinions and just doing what you want to do. Jumping, you know, if you will. It's, it's not easy at first because as much as we fear failure, we also fear success, you know? And so we're, we're kind of scared of not only what people will say, but what happens if we go after our dreams and we succeed? Like, you know what I mean? Like it's, it can be an uncomfortable situation. And when you don't have a safety net, you put all your time, energy into it. Nine times out of 10, most people that do that, end up do succeeding in the way that they want you know and success is different it's subjective it's it's for everybody you know what i mean it's not just for the ultra wealthy or just for people who are textbook or you know have the most education is for everybody you know what i mean success is subjective to whatever you want it to be for your life and i would say for my life pretty successful um we feel like as a society today that we have to we have to have the biggest this, the latest this, the greatest this, the best this to be successful. And it's just not I feel like it's just not true. You know? Um you can find success every day. Just in the mundane things, you know. But I just I just want you to jump, man, because you don't want to get Later on in life, that could be 50, that could be 100. You know, there's no room in your casket for regrets. You know, like you don't want to have any any regrets when you get older. You don't want to feel like, oh man, I should have, should have, could have, would have, right? 
So just go out there, man. And regardless of the backlash, the criticism, the, the judgment, the eyes on you, like, like what's the worst that can happen? You got nothing to lose, right? Like you got, you got nothing to lose, man. Like, you know, it's when you live without that safety net, you no longer, just be honest, you no longer give a shit. And doors start like opening up for you, you know? I don't wanna make this video too long. I just wanted to, plus, cause I'm a little out of breath. Cause again, a lot of steps, but I just want you to know I, I believe in you and just go after it, man. I mean, at the end of the day, if you don't fear failure or success, you don't have a safety net, like, man, you're like, okay, I succeeded, great. Okay, I failed, so what? Like, you're on to the next thing, right? Like, it doesn't bother you, like, look at that. I'm not gonna jump, but, right now at least, but, <laughs> but you get what I'm saying as a concept, right? And, and I encourage you to read Steve Harvey's book because he talks about this and talking about being a struggling comedian and trying to book shows and get gigs and things like that. And he just had to go after it. You know, certain people didn't approve, but and look where he's at now. So so like I say, just jump guys and at the end of the day, whether you succeed or fail, just keep your head up, keep pushing forward. You just gotta have a so what, a so what attitude, right? So, I love you. Thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna get back to this hike, save my energy, save my breath, right? Like the video, share it with whoever you want to, if you want to. Also, leave a comment below if this video resonate with you or you know you're gonna jump now right and you're gonna go after it because i want you to i want you to succeed um but it makes b signing out i'll see you guys later wish me luck